I'm Dr. William Carbeth. We're out at uh, Clovis uh, Community Medical Center and using, for the first time at Clovis, the Da Vinci XI robot, which is a relatively new robot, but designed primarily for those operations that require multiple quadrants. The operation that's being done today is a lady that has diverticular disease, and so the robot is helping us tremendously in being able to approach that disease, mobilize the, the colon, and if we need to, we can get up into a different region of the abdomen. So your more complicated robotic cases, like your colon cases and your thoracic cases, this robot is designed for those procedures. I've been doing robotic surgery since 2009. I have done upwards of over 400 plus cases. I've had the opportunity in that time to use every version of the robot, from the original robot to the S to the SI, and now the XI. This would have been an uh, extremely difficult case open. If it was an open operation, it would have been at least a seven, maybe a 10-day hospitalization. A significantly increased opportunity for complications. As much of that operation was done robotically, dramatically decreases those things from occurring uh, for this particular patient. My name is Yijin Wu. I'm a gynecologic oncologist. I primarily take care of cancer patients, and cancer patients really have a limited time. I think what minimally invasive surgery allows us to do is to get the patients back to their life as fast as possible. I've been really looking forward to having an opportunity to use the new XI robot. It's overall an easier tool, and I think the for me it's going to be the ability to be able to work both in the pelvis and in the upper abdomen, which means that the patients have a much better chance of getting better quicker, being able to see their medical oncologist or radiation oncologist is faster, and hopefully finishing their treatments faster as well. The SI that we've had here at Clovis for the last few years uh, in this past quarter had the highest volume or its busiest robot than all of their robots worldwide. Uh, it's pretty exciting. It's, uh, as I mentioned, the, this robot uh, really does uh, change the game for the more complicated robotic cases. Puts the, the eyes of the operation back in the hands of the surgeon. Uh, and that, that's, that's where things really have to be.